Hello everyone, this is Akif from Unic Lab and today I am going to demonstrate you office hysteroscope and hysterojet. 2.9 mm office hysteroscope and this is 2.9 mm hysteroscope. This is just a scope and this is 30 degree. You can see from here. This is 30 degree and built in quality you can see. Okay. Now this is seat. This is a diagnostic seat. This is operative seat, and we can detach from here. Uh, this is the button locking so that the water will not uh, out come out from here uh, because of leakage. You can we just have to push this button and detach like this. Now you can see this. This is very simple. This is 3.2 mm and this is 4.7 mm. You can see. UL 4.7 mm, Unic Lab 4.7 mm. This is our hysteroscopy seat, and this is uh, diagnostic seat. This is operative. This is diagnostic. This is the out, out water outlet channel, and this is the water inlet channel. Channel. This is the instrument channel for five French instrument, and we have to put uh, a scope from here. We have to go match this alignment and just push this scope like this we have notch here we have we can see easily and we have to insert this and close like this uh, most in most of the hysteroscope we face problem in this uh, locking because when we are doing the hysteroscopy procedure we have to move your hand and uh, at that time we most of the time we touch this and it will open and it will detach from here but uh, this locking is little hard and it will remain hard throughout uh, hysteroscopy processor okay uh, throughout the life of hysteroscope sorry and we, we have to insert scissors from here this is the instrument channel okay you can insert scissor from here just have to hold little bit uh, or this is first time I'm doing uh, with this washer so it is hard little bit but if you will insert from here this is the scissor you can just I will sew scissor and cut this you will have to hold like this and use like this okay now this is the solution for hysteroscopy office procedure you can use in uh, office procedure on in OT for diagnostic and operative for both cases for diagnostic cases if you have nulliparra patient you have to just pull this button and uh, push this button sorry and you in, remove this outer sheath this inner sheath will uh, use for uh, hist uh, diagnostic hysteroscopy and this outer sheath will for operative hysteroscopy and if uh, you have patient uh, multi para patient and other patient you can use directly because it is too narrow for uh, hysteroscopy procedure and it is more you can use it okay now come to the histogen this is a Unilab product Unilab it is a make in India product uh, because since last 5 to 10 years we are buying our product from maximum from uh, outside of our country and we don't have any proper manufacturer of uh, equipment most of the people are doing assembling but now Unilab have started their own product and manufacture this one we have a range of product like a hysteroscope, hysterojet this is hysterojet okay the same product and uh, this is light source and we have in CO2 insufflator and hysteroscope and gastro light source and all other range of products first I have I will demonstrate this one okay we have to uh, power on from here just press like this this will show Uniblack medical pump okay again it will show the start Prime. you have just uh, you have to touch this one very gently okay you have just touch it and uh, gently I am uh, telling you gently to, just because of that it will run little bit uh, to show you that the machine is functioning okay so if we keep pressing it it will 
rotate it will rotate it will keep rotating okay this is uh, like uh, every histo jet have their own traditional features like uh, they have pressure of 400 mm and there are very other surgeons and all are saying that the pressure high and is not good for but uh, i will tell you just a very simple thing that if you will buy a car from market and it have pressure it have a speed of 400 and we don't you don't have to uh, drive your car at the 400 speed so a speed uh, you can use according to your need if you have to drive it at the 40 if you drive it at 30 20 it depend on you it will totally depend on you if I have, you have car of Audi and Jaguar and all that if you use it more than 5 you don't have to drive it at that time so same here if you have to use it at uh, 80 pressure 85 75 pressure you can use it if you have to in some cases if you will face if you have used your uh, dilator before um, hysteroscopy before inserting hysteroscope and if you uh, if you have to do the uh, TURP and you have 4 mm scope with uh, that uh, 6.5 mm to 8 mm um, seat so the service will become more wide and water outflow will be more so we need high pressure at that time that's why this is designed to give maximum pressure at that time this is 400 mm g pressure and you can just uh, this is self test two additional feature Unilab have given uh, in its equipment first uh, we have to just check the self test self test is we, ha we don't have to use uh, every time this is for the routine check of a machine that machine is functioning well or not B because uh, histojet we don't, we don't have histojet and then every setup we have to carry it uh, at some other places some other hospital and somewhere else but in transportation uh, with after some time of life uh, uh, of around uh, four to five year ten year something if anything is uh, not functioning proper if you will just press the self test it will detect if machine have any fault in it okay this is for the life we don't have to uh, check it every time but this is uh, machine demonstration first i have i will show you how to do the self test this is this uh, will go into ns i wasted I, I don't have here right now because i am shooting this in my own room okay i will just have to insert this into my tub and show you I will just we need to just press this uh, self test button and we need to close this because if pressure will uh, come to that uh, uh, level then only it will abort that thing okay just press the self test now machine has started okay. will show that the 100 is okay now uh, it will show 200 is okay and at 300 mm of pressure machine is okay and 400 mm of pressure it will technically abort we, uh, first we have to need the abort but uh, when we are doing the self test it will after self test it will automatically come to the main screen this is the main screen okay <coughs> Unilab have given one more additional feature in uh, histojet and this is flush because whenever you have to connect uh, our hysteroscope with uh, inner seat and we have to do the procedure okay so for that at that time we need to connect this with uh, hysteroscopy seat and uh, on this uh, irrigation and uh, to uh, clean the seat and uh, to pass water little bit from seed okay for cleaning seed or other bubble issues okay so uh, at that time uh, we just press the irrigation and wait for uh, water to come out but uh, we have no we don't have the maximum pressure at that time because we have to, we have to use uh, 250 150 uh, and 100 pressure in cases so we have set already set this screen set this pressure at uh, 
100 and 100 pressure is not that much enough to clean the seat because flush any flush we have very high pressure machine will get uh, maximum pressure in within 10 seconds and it will fresh it will come water will come at very high pressure and your seat will become clean okay we we'll just have to uh, hold this flush button okay now she machine will gain the maximum pressure this uh, instrument channel is open that's why water is coming out now machine will gain maximum pressure and water will come in like you can see this okay but it will uh, if you will do with uh, irrigation it will take more time and at in hysteroscopy procedure we are always in hurry and so we need to finish this case as soon as possible so uh, we just need to place the uh, hold this uh, flush channel sorry flush channel and after that we will set the required pressure from here to increase this pressure we need to touch it and to uh, sorry uh, increase we need to touch here and to decrease we need to touch here okay pressure will shift what pressure we will need we need to minimum pressure machine have minimum pressure of 50 mmg because there is no need of pressure of between between uh, below 15 mm of hg and uh, we have to shift from here machine set okay so pressure is set and this is the actual pressure this is the actual pressure we have another different uh, uh, slab for this this uh, maximum uh, set pressure okay set pressure is here and actual pressure is here <coughs> all machine have their uh, fluctuating on the same screen like set pressure they can show they are showing set pressure here and uh, preset pressure here and actual pressure here on the same screen the both are fluctuating so it's a little bit disturbing so uh, we have designed this our equipment to uh, provide maximum okay maximum uh, we can say that uh, without any disturbation disturbance you can get the watt pressure that machine is currently what pressure machine is providing currently okay it will flex it will show here okay if will pressure and now sorry now uh, if you have to just uh, shift uh, flow rate this is the flow rate button and you can increase decrease from here and just we need to if we will set the now pressure we I have set pressure of uh, uh, 175 mmHg and flow rate at 800 ml 800 ml per minute sorry ml per minute okay you just have to start the irrigation button now <coughs> water will come out accordingly our pressure it is not it will not detecting any cavity that's why it, it will stop and if I will close this seat, the pressure will increase from here. Let me just show you. And I just close it. Okay. Okay. So it's very easy to do hysteroscopy procedure with HistoJet as we will not, uh, we don't need any assistant to hold that uh, saline portal continuously and Okay, continuously and tell them to press because it's uh, almost hard and uh, and we whenever we need <coughs> pressure we just have to say that uh, increase more increase more increase they, they have just pressing uh, the bottle and they have no idea what pressure I am uh, giving uh, through the tube through his through his to scope to the uterus okay so safety is uh, first and for that we, I will recommend to use histojet in every histoscopy processor diagnostic or there is the operative or you are using TURP in other cases ok and this is uh, Unilab HY1000 and this is our histoscope this is uh, too narrow design like uh, stores have their own histoscope uh, of uh, 4.7 mm and a striker have they are not purporting that much they have and olympus have their hysteroscope so this this is the indian hysteroscope 
histrojet this seat is this sorry this scope is german and this all things are made in india so price is very good if you want to know about the price i am just uh, uh, giving you my contact details below and you can find uh, we can di discuss if you have any case i will recommend you to keep cases and let me know i will come to uh, demonstrate you and uh, my product and I will assist you in diagnostic cases. Okay. Later we will discuss about the price and all things. Okay. Um, thank you. Thank you so much for watching.